what's up YouTube, I'm Clifford here. A lot of you guys have been asking me um, what the program that I've been using in my uh, recent dual videos is, um, and it's actually called DevPro. I'm going to have a little tutorial for you guys here on how to get it. Um, just make sure that you guys are using a uh, Windows computer with Windows 7 or 8 on it. Um, it's a download-based application that you have to have on your computer to run it. Um, it runs from your computer. Um, it's not, uh, you know... Windows or uh, yeah, internet based like dueling network, uh, but so forth. Um, it's a really good program. Um, the rulings are automated. Um, yeah, sometimes the system is wrong um, on newer cards, but it's all good. Um, so, guys, um, to get this, like I said, make sure you're using a Windows computer. Um, you're going to go to devpro.org. So, D E V P R O dot O R G. Um, you're going to just simply open it up um, once it loads up for you, um, as you can see here. Um, it's a pretty basic um, website, as you can see here. Um, everything's going to pop up. You can read through um, some of their stuff that they have on their site. Um, there's a lot of interesting reads. Um, they do help promote other YouTubers um, if you guys are doing something um, to help promote DevPro. Um, you're going to go to the downloads tab as you guys can see here da, da, da. the downloads tab this is actually the one place you want to be um, Devro is actually available in four languages which is really nice um, so you guys are going to click download ha 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 um, you're going to get this nice little window to open up here with all of the information in it um, it's going to give up everything that you guys need um, you guys are going to scroll down here and you see this cool little download button right here you're going to click that and then the program should start downloading you'll just save the file um, once the files down are done downloading um, it will appear on your desktop so here and then you'll just run it um, do all the basic stuff um, basically what's going to happen is once you have it installed you're going to get the cool little dark magician girl um, emblem here and then devpro is probably going to boot up and ask you for all of your basic information um, basically, once you get logged in, I'll show you guys all the cool stuff that DevPro actually has to offer here. Um, like I said, um, when you play the replays, um, everything will be, you know, auto show. Um, you don't get to see your opponent's hand while you're playing. A lot of people seem to um, be like, oh, that's not the way that it works. No, um, it's not the way it is. Um, this is what DevPro actually looks like when it's booted up. Um, we'll log out here. So, we can show you guys the actual screen here. Uh, I guess it's not going to... Oh, there we go. Alright. So, as you guys can see here, um, you have the basic login screen. Um, you'll just click register to register. Um, there's also a really cool offline mode. Uh, the offline mode is actually where I do most of my stuff. That way you don't have to be connected to the server um, to do anything. As you can see, you can log into the multiplayer, single mode, uh, watch replay. Um, to watch replay, basically the system will give you your list of replays. Um, you'll save your replays after each duel, um, as you can see here, and then it just plays them for you. Um, the kind of sad thing is sometimes the replays will crash um, depending on how things are going. Um, as you can see there, it loads it, you can pause it, you can you know play it step by step, um, go through each phase. It's actually very nice. Um, outside of that, once again, back to offline mode here. Um, you can deck edit as well in the offline mode, which is also very nice. Um, that way you know you don't have to connect to the server. Um, good example of this clicking deck edit here. <laughs> um, all of the deck list, um, everything that you need are all um, in here. Um, they're all based in files. Um, you can go directly to the apps folder and edit everything through there. Um, just really good examples of that. Um, um, once you have your login information, you'll just go ahead and log in to DevPro. Um, make sure you connect to the server that's closest to you. Um, if you guys connect to, you know, like the faraway European server, your response time might be a little bit slower um, in terms of that. Um, it's really up to you, though. I mean, you can play on a European-based server, or, you know, you can stay here closer to America. Just have to wait uh, for DevPro to boot. Um, once you're inside of DevPro, um, like I said, the application's up to go. Um, the chat is actually very nice as well. Um, the moderators, you can tell which color they are. Um, they do have tournaments on here as well. Um, you can also uh, manage your files and your replays through the system itself. Um, you can delete them, do as you need to. Um, you can also set your um, card sleeves in here. 
and then they have a nice little about tab to explain uh, things to you as well. Uh, so yeah, DevPro, it's a very nice application. Um, pretty basic. Uh, like I said, the important thing is you guys want to make sure that you guys connect to the right server. Um, bad things can happen if you guys start to lag out and you guys kind of complain. Uh, DevPro also has this uncanny ability to crash, which kind of stinks um, at times. It, just wait for it to recover. Um, it's very, very easy to do. Um, you just have to kind of sit back and wait a little bit. But outside of that, it's probably because I'm doing this video. But yeah, uh, that's DevPro in a nutshell. Guys, um, if you guys want to host games on it, it's pretty easy to do. Um, you guys will find the ability to do that just by, you know, clicking on the DevPro USA tab here, and it would pretty much let you do that. So, I'm going to conclude this video um, with that. That's my little tutorial on how to walk through it. Um, if you guys are interested in getting it, it's on devpro.org. Um, everything's there. I understand the program does have its times where it's just like, oh, we're going to crash. Um, but for now, I'm out, guys. Later.